What are you doing? I'm getting kitty kisses. You give me kitty kisses? I don't think you want makeup. Do you want makeup? Maybe I'll get you guys the kitty box next month. How's that? We'll take a break from Ipsy and get a kitty box next, week, next month. Everyone and welcome to my channel if you're new I'm Jen and this is my channel so what we're gonna do today is the ipsy unboxing I have ipsy I also have ipsy plus and we're going to see which one is better I would expect ipsy plus to be better because it's more expensive but first before I get into that let me tell you if you're not familiar with what ipsy is ipsy is a subscription makeup service and every month you get one of your choice they do both and this is my first time getting ipsy plus so i'm not sure what to expect i think it said five full-size products i have not peeked at what's inside both of them are closed so the ipsy service is ten dollars a month plus tax and the ipsy plus is 24.95 a month plus tax and like i said it's every month I have been getting Ipsy for a number of years now. I have been, this is my, like I said, my first Ipsy Plus. But this will be my last Ipsy subscription for the summer. I have decided to do no makeup and be all natural all summer to try to get my skin more healthy. Um, I don't usually wear a lot of makeup and I feel like, like it's kind of wasteful with money because I don't wear a lot of makeup. I just usually wear eye makeup or lip gloss and I usually want to get the products because of the nail polish but I can just buy a bottle of nail polish for what I spend on the Ipsy service. I do love it and I probably probably will go back to it in the fall um, but just for the summer I kind of want to simplify things so we got this this month and this will be the last and it's pretty late in the month it's almost the month is almost over but I had my Ipsy bag, I got my Ipsy first, and then I was just waiting for this to come. My Ipsy Plus came about a week later, and then I haven't been feeling well, so this is the first chance I've got to film it. So we're going to dive in and see what we got. I'll do the Ipsy first, because I'm just excited, and that was just what I choose to do. So let's see what I got in my Ipsy bag this month. Like I said, I did not peek. This is the May bag. Gorgeous bag. I am in love with this bag. Look at how sparkly it is. I love anything sparkly, so definitely love that. And then this was in the bag with it also. It did not fit in the bag. So let's get the cart out first. It also comes with a card and it tells you about the products in your bag. So let's just start with the one that was loose in the bag. This is a F-A-R-A-H. I'm not sure if you just pronounce the letters because there's a period between each one. Or if you say the name Farah, Farah, I don't know. But this is the brush. It's very pretty two-sided and it says the Farrah brushes 22e shade and blend it says this brand's goal to create luxurious high quality affordable products this stylish dual-ended brush is so versatile use it to apply and blend shadows contour highlights and more plus who could resist that eye-catching iridescent handle very unicornish and here's the tip it says use this brush to apply concealer under your eyes set under eye makeup with powders highlight the inner corners of your eyes and contour small areas like your nose I probably should use some kind of cover-up but I don't like putting I don't like putting stuff on my face I've never have so I just go with the blotchy look it's good for me. It works for me. 
Alright, my next product I'm pulling out, it looks like it is a silky eye pen. And of course we have to open it. Alright, that was a struggle trying to get the lid off. So this is a Pixie eye pen. And it's Pixie by Petra. Endless silky eye pen and copper glow. I'll swatch it. It's really pretty. That's what it looks like. And that's the tip. Alright, and here's what it says. It says, founded by a working mom of four, Pixie by Petra is all about products that make multitasking easy. This gel textured, waterproof, smudge proof, long wear eyeliner glides on easy and, and deposits highly pigmented metallic copper color. It is very pigmented. Tip, line your eyes from the inner corner of your eye outward, thickening the line as you reach the outer corner. For a smoky effect, blend using an angled eyeliner brush. Very good idea. I definitely will try that. All right, my next product is this little cutie. Let me turn my light so you can not see a glare. That's a little bit better. This is the Feel Bright Daily Squalane Plus Facial Oil. This brand believes that skincare has the potential to change your world, and they're not wrong. This non-greasy formula boasts a blend of squalene, I have no clue what that is, rose hip and avocado oils to help brighten, firm, and plump and nourish your skin, and vitamin E to help fight acne and blemishes. Tip, after cleansing, pat a dime-sized amount onto your skin. Feeling extra dry? Follow with your favorite moisturizer. I'm definitely going to try give that a try because my face is definitely, I have dry skin. And here comes my cat. Alright, I had to take a, a kitty crossing break. I think we're back and I think we're good. So let's try again. My next product, that was one, two, three. My fourth product, oh, it's in a jar. That's a big sized sample. This is the Innisfree Pore Clearing Clay Mask with Super Volcanic Clusters. Fancy. It's very thick. Oh. It's very thick. There's a good amount in there for a sample. That's a really good sample size. So this is the Innisfree sources, the finest, most natural ingredients from Jeju Island in Korea, including the volcanic clusters infused in this mask. The multitasking formula helps minimize the appearance of pores, absorbs oils, gently exfoliates, cleanses, and evens out skin tone. Tip, wash your face and pat dry. Then apply this mask all over your face evenly and let sit for 15 minutes. Rinse off with lukewarm water. Very nice, I cannot wait to try that. I love masks. All right, my fifth and final product is this. It's super cute packaging. And on the side it says, I am not missing out. Oh, it's upside down. I'm not missing out, it says. Kind of hard to see, I think. There you go. And this is the Inmo Velveteen Dream Eyeshadow in Super Bass. And this is Inmo, it says, Inmo delivers on trend products that make creating eye-catching beauty looks easy and fun. 
This shimmery light mauve shadow is a fresh shade that screams spring. Bonus, it goes on creamy and lasts for hours without creasing. Tip, apply this light mauve shadow on your lids using your finger or blend and blend out with a fluffy brush. Hmm. Okay, let's see what it looks like. Super cute packaging. I love the packaging. Ooh, that is pretty. Let me swatch it. And there is the shade. Super pretty shade. I think that could definitely be used as a, um, a blush if you use blush. I don't use blush because my cheeks are already red and rosy on their own. They don't need any kind of help with that. So there is my May Ipsy bag. All right, so that is Ipsy. Now we'll move on to Ipsy Plus for the month. All right, let's move on to Ipsy Plus for the month. Like I said, this is my first time getting it. I don't plan to, even when I go back to Ipsy in the fall, I'm not going to, I don't think. I probably shouldn't put the scissors that near my face. I do that all the time. Um, I have no plans of keeping Ipsy Plus on a regular basis. $25 a month is pretty expensive to me. And I just have other things I could put the money towards. It's I'm sure it's probably worth it. We'll see if it's worth it, but it's just not something I choose to do. But I did want to try it and see what it was like at least once. Alright, I'm kind of Disappointed. I know that they can't put these big size products in a bag, but it's kind of a plain box. I was hoping for like sparkles or bubbles or something. So it says on the inside, Glam Bag Plus. And then it says, don't be pretty like them. Be pretty like you. All right, so the top is covered with a piece of foam. Also, not, I don't like that. I mean, I know they have to insulate it, or so, you know, like keep it from breaking, but you'd think it would be pink, since Ipsy is pink or something, but not too impressed with this blue foam stuff. So here's what the inside looks like. There are my products. There's the card that tells me about all the products. There's quite a few products inside. So it just, off the top, it does look like it is worth the $24.95 that I paid for it, um, especially if you are a makeup person. So I think that's definitely worth it. So let's start and see what the first one is and we'll go in order. This is the first one. And this is, now you guys know I'm not good at pronouncing things. This is the EAU Thermal Avenue Soothing Moisture Mask. It's valued at $26. And it says your daily moisturizer is good, but incorporating a super hydrating mask into your skincare routine will moisturize your skin the way a face cream can. This mask is powered by spring water, which penetrates deep into the skin to soothe, soften, and calm a stressed out complexion. It's so hydrating, it even provides instant relief for burns, sunburns, and the day-to-day -day redness. Plus, it's gentle enough for even the most sensitive skin. This is definitely something I could be, that I could like because we all know how red and blotchy my skin is. So this is definitely something I'm looking forward to trying. I'm going to try this. This afternoon actually it's just a white cream and here is how you use it it says apply a thick layer to clean dry skin once or twice a week allow your skin to soak up all the good stuff for 10 to 15 minutes the cream will stay creamy 
so don't worry about it drying out on you. Tissue off any excess and voila. So there's no need to moisturize, you just wipe off the excess that isn't absorbed into your skin. Pretty cool, I can't wait to try that because like I said, we definitely know about my blotchiness, so I hope maybe that would be something that would help, plus it's good for sensitive skin, which I have. All right, the next product would be this. This is really cool. This is the Wander Beauty Wondrous Seascape Eyeshadow Palette. Oh, how cool. I love this packaging. Oh, and it even has a mirror. I don't think I've ever had an eyeshadow palette, like an honest to goodness palette. So this is really cool. This is a $25 value, and like I said, it's the Wander Beauty Wander Seascape Eyeshadow Palette. Very pretty packaging. It's a beach scene. And it has a mirror. Look at those pretty shades. And the shades are, we'll start up here, Champagne Harbor, Sea Salt, Golden Reef, Sand Dollar, Sea Foam, and Coastal. Very pretty shades. And of course we have to swatch them all. So there we have the Coastal. Very shimmery, very shimmery shades. All right, let's, let's read about the Wondrous Beauty Palette. The Wander Beauty Six Pan Eyeshadow Palette can transport you to the tropics for a lot less than a plane ticket. Loaded with a mix of foil, shimmery, satin, and matte finishes in shades of sea foam, deep blue, sandy brown, sea salt pink, and warm golds, these pigmented shadows infused with skin-loving ingredients can create endless looks on and off the beach. Very pretty. I like that. It's a nice, very nice thick packaging. It has like a magnet closing. Very nice. I like that. All right. The next product is this and it is the to go face hero it's valued at $34 it says it's the box says it's a powerful and protective face oil so let's open it first it has a dropper lid definitely an oil texture and let's read about this. It's go-to face hero. This multitasking good-for-you cocktail of natural ingredients comes to the rescue by hydrating parched skin, brightening dull complexions, and soothing inflammation. It also helps combat fine lines, dark spots, and early signs of aging. Do you think they're trying to tell me something? Maybe. And no worries about residue. Here's looking at you, oily and combination complexions. Your skin will soak it up quickly. Tip, massage five drops onto clean skin after your daily serum, or mix a few drops into a dollop of your favorite moisturizer and massage into your skin for all day hydration. Definitely look forward to trying that because like I said, my skin is red and it is dry. So definitely another good product. Okay, the next one is this foilia pack, and this is the IL Makich, Makich Icon High Volume and Intense Curl Mascara. Ooh, we 
all know that I'm a sucker for mascara. And this is valued at $25. That's what the wand looks like. All right, so this is, like I said, the IL Mockish. I don't know how to say it. Valued at $25. When you can't be bothered to fumble with falsies, reach for a mascara that pumps up your natural lashes minus the messy glue. The football-shaped silicone brush grips and coats even the tiniest of lashes, lifting, curling, and length lengthening all at once. Very cool. Here's the tip. Starting at the base of your lashes, wiggle the wand in an upward motion from the root to the tip for extra length and volume. Want even more drama? Apply as many coats as you want without fear of clumping. Plus, it's light, lightweight so it won't weigh down your lashes. Very cool. You cannot go wrong with mascara, in my opinion. All right, next, let's see what's next, is, oh, I got two of these. This is the Ilamasca, Ilamasca Lip Coloring Pencil Duo in Lust and Media. Alright, let's look at first, we'll look at the media. I'm not really a lip pencil kind of person, but I would definitely be willing to try it and see what it's like. This is the media lip pencil. Lust. You can see the lust is a bit darker than the media. Very awesome. All right, these are valued at twenty-one dollars each. Because there's nothing worse than lipstick that feathers, bleeds, and smudges, it's time to incorporate a lip pencil into your routine. This super pigmented lip pencil shades Lust, a coral pink, and Media, a cranberry red, lock your lipstick in place all day and add tons of dimension. Very nice. I don't usually wear lipstick, but I know you can use this with some gloss as add just like a lipstick kind of thing or a lip shade. So I'll definitely give that a try. Now I have two more products that are not listed. Actually, I have three more products that are not listed. Oh, okay. My bad. These three items I got with, I redeemed my points. And these I'm going to be including in a giveaway in June. So I'm not going to open them, but I'll tell you what they are. Um, that's why there was three extra so you get you do get five products in your box not eight like I said the other three were I redeemed my points because a lot of you guys used my 
um, referral code and I got extra points and I got, you guys probably got I know you did get points too so when you get enough points you can redeem them for free products so these are my three free products that I got and like I said I'll be giving these in a giveaway next month with a makeup bag um, I'll choose a summary bag because I have tons of bags and they're all clean and in good shape because I don't use them so be watching next month and I'll let you know when the, that giveaway is. I have a couple of giveaways coming up in the month of June. So first I picked this because I have one of these and I just love it because it's sparkly and it reminds me of a unicorn and cotton candy. And then I picked the Jelly Pong Pong eyeshadow. Um, it's a multifunctional pigment. I'll show you. I'm not going to swatch it, but I will show you. Oh, it's a loose pigment. It's in a pretty blue, iridescent blue shade. So we're going to put the lid back on that because I don't want it to get dirty. And then the last one is in bubble wrap. And we can just see through this. This is the L. Eden. And that is also an eyeshadow. So I picked two eyeshadows and a shadow brush. And like I said, next month in June, I will be giving away those in a cosmetic bag. And you guys can enter to win that if you're interested. So that is my Ipsy versus Ipsy Plus for the month. Definitely, I think the Ipsy Plus was worth it. There was all the products were at least $20. Um, there are five products, so over $100 value in the box. Definitely worth the $25 if you're into makeup. I'm definitely interested in the oils, the moisturizers for my skin. So I cannot wait to try that. When I do, I will let you know next month when I have my giveaway how that worked out for me. Alright, I'll see you guys later. Bye!